Hello guys, yeah. welcome back to the lineup. For today's video, we are going to show you how to fix Steel Series Apex Pro TKL keys not working. So, if you're having problems with your keyboard here, there are going to be a few things that you could try. So, first thing that you want to do is you want to check the physical connections here. So, ensure the keyboard is securely connected to your computer. So, also just make sure that the meta part is not uh, exposed. So, make sure it's properly plugged in. Also, try using a different USB port to rule out a faulty connection and test the keyboard on another computer if you can. Now, if the keys work there, the issue is with your original computers or, in this case, your computer's USB ports or settings. Now, next thing that you could do here is you might want to restart your computer. Now, sometimes a quick restart or a simple restart can sometimes fix temporary self-related issues affecting your keyboard. And also, you might want to, to uh, you maybe want to perform a factory reset. So, in this case, you want to go ahead and plug your keyboard here. And from then on, you want to go ahead and hold down the LED menu button plus the scroll wheel at the same time. Now, from then on, while holding this button, so connect your keyboard and release the buttons while the lighting flashes indicating a successful reset. Now, also, you might want to reinstall your keyboard drivers. So, in this case, you want to go and open up your device manager. So, in your computer, you want to go to search here, just type in device manager. And in here, you want to go and search for keyboards. So, in this case, keyboard. And you want to look for your SteelSeries Apex Pro TKL here. Just right click on it and just click on uninstall device. Now just follow the on-screen steps that you'll be seeing here. And once you've uninstalled this, restart your PC and see if that solves your issue. Now if that doesn't work, you could actually perform a act um for example actuation calibration. So in this case, you want to unplug your keyboard from your computer. You want to hold down the seal series uh, key on your keyboard and also the I key and the O key together at the same time. Now, while holding these keys, plug your keyboard back in, press each Omni Point key until it bottoms out. Now, save the calibration by pressing the Steel Series key and the I and O buttons or keys again, and the keyboard will save the new values and turn to normal operation. And finally, the last thing that you could do here is to basically just clean out your keyboard. Sometimes a 30 or, in this case, a um, a keyboard that is not properly maintained here can cause a lot of issues so in this case just clean it so if you have the tools that to remove the keys each here and clean each out you can go ahead and do that but yeah so if none of those work and your uh, keyboard here is fairly new it means that the problem itself is going to be the keyboard so it's best to contact the steel series support but in this case that's about it hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to your lineup thank you for watching